Um, hello everybody. Welcome to Vince's Inspirations. Um, I wanted to share with you, well, first of all, today, I hope everybody's doing well. Today is July 13th. It's a Saturday and it's my birthday. So I wanted to share with you what I chose for my birthday meal. Um, I, I thought I had the volume up, but apparently I didn't. And um, so I did do a voiceover, which is so unfortunate. It's early 6.30 a.m. when I started this. So it's really early. I mean, you know, you're just rising up. All I did was uh, freshen up in the bathroom and go straight to the kitchen. But I wanted turkey burgers. I wanted a turkey burger because some are consist of burgers on the grill. I'm not grilling because I'm going out with friends and I can't do both because grilling is a lot of work. Got to bring it outside, stand there and watch it and start the fire. And then you got to clean, you know. So I just decided to uh, bake my uh, turkey burgers. And I chose the, the most least expensive things and the, tried to make the healthiest thing out of this meal that I wanted for my birthday. Uh, turkey burgers with bacon and I got pepper jack cheese. I got sesame seed buns and... um. I got some vegetarian baked beans. Oh my gosh, delicious. I got jalapeno peppers and we're going to go through them as, a, yeah, I, I hate I had to do a voiceover. And that's not my favorite mustard, but it was the cheapest. So the mustard's for the hot dogs. And I decided not to even cook the hot dogs because I, it was just too exhausting. So I put the hot dogs in the freezer. I don't know what I'm going to do with the hot dog buns. These are sour jalapeno peppers. They're like sweet and hot or, yeah, sour and hot, I think. I love them. And I have the fresh jalapeno. I forgot to add it in the um the video. They're still, they were in the refrigerator. I, I, when I started slicing up the vegetables, I realized I had to get them. So those are the jalapeno peppers. And then I got some pickles. I wanted a bigger size pickle, but this is what uh, they sent me. I used Instacart. I know some cities and states, they, they may not have Instacart. It's a delivery service for fresh items and a million other things. But if you want, like, takeout, you really got to use Uber Eats. And I know a lot of cities and states use Uber Eats. And see, I got the vegetarian baked beans. I got some veggies. Always add your veggies in. And I got a red onion as well. Um, you could use uh, the wheat buns. Normally when I use the wheat buns, when, only when I buy the wheat buns, they have, like, a moldy smell, I guess, because they don't sell as fast. So I tend to stay away from them. And I don't like them anyway. And I love the sesame seed buns. Remember, guys, I'm only going to have one burger, probably just half a burger, so I'm fine. It's just something that I had been craving because I hadn't had a, a burger all summer. And I got some turkey bacon. I love Oscar Mayer. It's my favorite. I love Oscar Mayer pork bacon and um, boar's head pork bacon, but I haven't had it in so long because it's not healthy for you. Um, this one's not even healthy, but it's just I'm just eating it for today. Oh, I can't wait to cook. And I mean, well, I already ate as I'm doing the voiceover. Yeah, I already ate. It was so, so tasty. Oh, my gosh. I ate less than half the burger. I And I'm doing fries, too, because there was potatoes in the house. And so I'm doing some uh, fresh fries on the side, uh, some sliced cucumbers on the side. You could do uh, uh, sweet potato fries. It's a healthier choice. And they have healthier cheeses as well. That cheese is not so healthy, but I'm just getting one slice and I'm only eating half the burger, so it's not too bad. I didn't show me cooking because I can't stress myself out with filming and editing. I didn't want to edit a long video. Yes, yeah, so I did it very short and simple. I showed you my ingredients and I'm going to show you how I played it up. So it's a very short video. Yeah, you guys know how to make burgers. <laughs> and what I do with my burgers is... I don't like to cook the ground turkey meat hard because I like it cooked gently. So what I do is when it's almost cooked, I slice it down the middle and let the inside cook. And then as I'm putting the cheese on, I put the burgers, I stack them back together, one on top of the, you know, the top piece on top of the bottom piece. And then I put the cheese on and then I put it in the broil, the broil in the oven for about two seconds. It takes very little time for it to melt. Yeah. So that's a great tip because if you over... If you try to cook the inside of your turkey burgers, the outside is so tough and hard. Have you noticed that? Yes. Yeah, so this is a trick. You just sear it on both sides a bit on like a 450 to 550 oven, depending on your oven temperature. And then when it looks like it's thick enough to hold and slice, you pick it up, hold it sideways, and you slice it down the middle and then flip it open, let it 
cook in the oven for another like couple of minutes and it's and then it's just perfect 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 nice soft and tender yes so eventually we'll get to me plating i don't know all i was saying you guys know i love to talk but happy birthday to all the cancers who if you're born in july please give me a shout out let me know your birthday so i can wish you a happy birthday in my upcoming video or even in the comments um i don't know how busy i'm gonna get today because i have a lot of things planned but, you know, I get in bed at least by 5, 30, 6 o'clock. So I have time to check my comments. If I'm in the mood, you know, it's my birthday. I'm going to be excited, worn out. I'm going to know I'm going to get a lot of calls. Um, Yeah, so we'll see. But um, this is what I wanted for my birthday. I didn't want a cheesecake, but I wanted to make my cheesecake. And that was just too much to do. So I'm going to, I'm still going to make my cheesecake for my birthday, but in another uh, another day and so that'll be another video and yes I know how to make a homemade cheesecake and I haven't made it in years so I'm gonna have to find some recipes I used to have a recipe book that I used to use the recipe out of years ago but that book Ben got thrown out or donated or whatever so I got to try to find a similar recipe because I want to make that same cheesecake is to die for and it's so 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 simple wait till you guys see it you're gonna be blown away I know you're gonna go grab the ingredients from your local supermarket and make it yourself and it tastes so much fresher than what you buy out of the store oh my goodness so like i said i don't know what i was talking about because <laughs> you know how i go on and on and on yeah so i'm just relaxing now i just came out the shower so i'll have guests in about another two hours so i get to relax for two hours so i plan my day perfectly when I'm done with this, I'm going to get some ice and put it, you know, when I have my surgery so I could be able to walk today and do what I need to do to go out. I'm trying to think, what was I talking about? I don't know. I have no clue. I can't even remember, but it looks like it was interesting, right? Because I'm, I'm still standing there and I, I've, I talked about all the ingredients already because I'm not picking up anything. So I'm not sure. I don't remember. Oh, no. What was I talking about? Oh, oh I can't remember. Maybe it was about my guests or I don't know how to cook healthy meals. I don't know what I was talking about. Yeah, I think I was talking about how to make make it much healthier. And what you eat, okay, I remember now, I was saying you could add more lettuce, uh, pickles, and um, peppers, and tomatoes, and onions to your, your, um, your, uh, your burger, and you could, that, so you could eat less burger, so like you can even cut your burger, you know, and add more veggies to make it like a high burger, you could even put fr a couple of fries in there, the sweet potatoes too, and that becomes much healthier. Because I know people tend to eat a big giant burger. That's not good. That ain't good. That's too much meat for your digestive system. Especially if you, you know, have issues like me. You have to really be cautious. Those peppers look so delicious. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> yeah. So I was saying that those peppers are healthy for you. And I think I was saying at that point that I don't like that mustard, but that was the cheapest one. Yeah. And so I was supposed to have been doing hot dogs with like a um, a cucumber slaw on top. Oh, it's to die for. Uh, a friend of mine taught me years ago. I think it, the recipe, is it from Texas? Mm, no, not Texas. I can't remember, but it's from some state. And, um, oh, my God, it's delicious. But it's a cucumber slaw that you put on top of your hot dog. But I decided to, you know what, the last minute I didn't want to do hot dogs. It's just too much work. Um, but they were supposed to pair with the beans. But I still made the beans because they still go with burgers. Especially the burger that I made with the black pepper jack cheese. That type of cheese pairs well with those sweet beans that I'm making. And when you're doing your sweet beans, don't add a lot of sugar. Put very little sugar. It's not good for your uh, high blood pressure. Or your heart so when I say sweet beans I don't mean sweet 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 just add a little brown sugar to give them a nice like savory taste and with the pepper and the onion and the garlic oh it's delicious yeah and I'm still talking my goodness <laughs> <laughs> 
know what I was talking about. <laughs> I don't have a clue. My goodness. I sure can go on and on. I do remember saying I need to stop talking so I could um I won't have to edit this video so long and and I like I want to stop now cuz I have things to do, you know. I don't even know what outfit I'm wearing today. I love that cute little outfit I have with the back out. So I may just wear that because it's so, so cute. I hope I find another one just like it. In fact, I did and I left it. So the next one I find, I'm going to keep because it looks so cute on me and I just love them. I never had nothing like that. An actual dress with a back out. Never had that. I had like a dress with no sleeves and no back, you know, all together. But this one has the sleeves. Okay, so Bon Appetit, there you have it. The, a burger with the uh, bacon and you got your lettuce, tomatoes. Oh, it's just... It was so delicious, and those buns were so fresh. And I know if I bought those wheat buns, they would have had that moldy smell. And the beans came out, oh, it was perfect how I like it. It was so savory, sweet at the same time, and then the spicy. I put bonnet pepper, so it was just a little bit. I chopped it very tiny because you don't want to bite a giant piece of pepper while you're eating the beans. Yeah. And then I put oh, uh, two tiny cloves of garlic and I smashed it and I, I tried this cream I think sunflower you telling me about some cream that you guys use your family rather I, I think this is it right but I got Caesar flavor because the store has every flavor because I couldn't find any other cream so I think that's it please let me know and then I sliced up veggies you know because I'm having guests they're going to eat and there's the fries and like I said you could do sweet potato fries if I planned on cooking fries with this meal, I would have ordered two large sweet potatoes, but I didn't have intentions on making fries. My son bought a big bag of potatoes, and they need to be cooked, so why not add them in? Because people love fries, yeah. And it was just so delicious. Everything paired so nice together. I really enjoyed it. I'm so happy that I got my burger for my birthday. Oh, it was just so special. So, so, so special. Oh, my gosh. Uh, please give me a happy birthday shout out in the comment, please. I'll be so grateful. So, so, so grateful. But you see how I sliced up everything. The peppers were real, t I mean, the, the pickles were real tiny. So I just put some, if you want a whole one, then I slice some and you just put a whole lot on your pepper, on your uh, hamburger. I had sliced mine on the bias, but I don't think that's going to bite well. So then I decided to slice some for guests. Yeah. And then I'm going to grab a couple of cucumbers. And um, like I said, happy birthday to all the cancers. Don't forget to, let, if you're a cancer, don't forget to let me know your birthday so I can give you a birthday shout out in, in the comment section or my next video. Just depends on how my day goes. Oh, I was so happy. Oh, <laughs> you know, you can just do little special things for yourself and it just goes a long way. But God bless and I love you guys.